welcome back to Eclipsed. So, we have to find somewhere in all of this these symbols. Okay, this ground floor guy. Let's just move around here. I wonder if there's anything around the other side of this room, actually. Wait, this, I'm confusing which one's which. This is ground floor guy. Is that what we're trying to do? Oh, it's a door I could open. Okay, we've got three pedestals. Some hanging chains. I mean, I don't have anything to put on pedestals, right? I mean, cut these surprises. I haven't tried cutting these surprises on these guys, but surely they're not going to do anything. Except make them angry. They seem to be immune to uh, swords. And we've got books, but putting books on pedestals doesn't make any sense to me. What have we got up here? Just a glowy light. Okay. I think that's the three objects for the portal, right? Wait, one of these guys goes the other way? Now I'm confused. I was expecting them both to walk the same direction there. Where's the second one? And I'm also suddenly realizing a circuit. He's upstairs. Ah, here's the second one, okay. He saw nothing. And he's gonna go into that side room. And come back out again. The guy upstairs is also gonna be wanting to go in there soon. Yeah, he's coming back. So we need to find a different set of symbols. That set of symbols of glyphs that the Keeper had is not what we needed. Yeah, the timing here is not ideal. Oh, he goes around the base. He doesn't come in here. Okay. Beaver on the wall. Which I can't seem to use, which is odd. Oh, that's the guy who keeps trying to use the locked door, right. Which is also weird. Sitting there, chilling. Oh, there's the stairs up. The stairs up, okay. Ah. And there's a door there. Use up these stairs, I can hear somebody up that way. 
Oh no, he's going to search. Yeah, he's not coming out. He's giving up. Alright, that's fine. He must have been standing up there seeing me. Oh, this guy goes upstairs too. So many, so few boy hours. Oh! Who's the guy who's just going up those stairs then? He's not this guy. Oh, we're here. Like I come back this way, I've forgotten. Okay, we come around in a circle. No, he came up these stairs and down that way, right? He's doing a long loop. He's the guy who I saw walking upstairs. That's the guy on the balcony who came down to explore, right? And we're here, okay. That's the keeper's room. So, so there's nothing more. So what the hell do I do then? Oh, I've got symbols on these books. Is this all the books I need? I don't know. Alright, well, let's find our way back to that. The room where we need the symbols. That's the library. We don't need the library. Order, but maybe we just do them. So, Ferentius's book does not have a glyph on it. We've got. I don't know how many we need, but four seems about right, <laughs> hopefully. Renuliev is the O with an antenna on top. Mavinth is the. Oh, oh God. Iris is the hash. And an H. So, we've got H, hash. Fancy curves T and the circle of antenna. Right, we're going to follow this guy upstairs because the timing is good for that. And we can stay out of the light as we do so. Hope. <laughs> Find these symbols. Does the order matter? If the order matters, we're kind of in trouble. That's the four of them. Yeah. Uh, okay, let's read the book that we can read. Does he say anything about the others? Talking about the relics. These are not the names, are they the, the relics are named for those? Okay, there's three of them, that's right.
No, he doesn't have anything to guide us, so what are we going on? We're just... I want error. That's gonna suck. We can try alphabetical order. H hash T globe. Ah, uh, guy's coming back upstairs again. I'm gonna have to wait for him. I don't think we can even stand at the end there, uh, safely, right? If we could wait at the end, it'd be fine, but. I mean, there's like 24 possibilities if we're trying them in random order, that's in, in different orders, which really sucks. I haven't seen anything mentioning any of these names, so no idea how we're supposed to figure out what order they go in. I also feel like we're completely in the wrong place to be right now for the mission, because... Uh, we haven't got the thing out of the... Uh, <sighs> the safe in the town, right? There's stuff in the town we haven't finished doing. Okay, so what are we doing? Outbreak order was, I should have done hash, hash, no, H hash, R T globe. That's H. H. Hash. T. Oh, that's not it either. Hmm. I just brute force this thing. H hash globe T, the guy's coming back. We're gonna get discovered here. No, he doesn't come this okay. Well maybe when he turns around he might bump into us, but if he just stops there, that's Ooh, he did sense us. H T Ash Globe H T Globe Ash Gosh this puzzle sucks. Um H Globe T hash H globe hash T. I don't even can't even keep track of what I've done. Uh, I can't remember which ones I've done, and I can't keep notes. And I don't have any information to go on. This is the only thing I actually, at the moment, have the capacity to do in the mission. Right. I can't read these to get any sense of any, any information from them, which... Should we try a cuddly surprise on him? I guess we might as well for funsies, right? That's not going to work. That's just going to get them all angry. That's a really bad idea. Oh, it did work. Two of them worked. I oh, now I've left one in my way. Well. Should allow me to brute force more uh, conveniently. So, well, we've done H. P pairs, we've done H globe, we've done H hash, we've done all the options starting with H, so we don't start with H. 
stuff. Oh, hang on. He's he's thinking too. I don't want to be seen. We might be able to lockpick the bear. I don't know, we have to try. I guess we don't have to try. We don't need fire arrows, right? No. Things we learnt. Arrows are not very good against them. Two cuddly bears, on the other hand, is is enough to trip them up. So if we leave this guy two cuddly surprises, he will stop bothering us. But the other guy is going to be annoying. Hash? No, wrong one. Hash. Hash. T. H. Globe. Hash. T. Globe H. Hash H. T globe. Go back now. Nah. Hash H globe T. That's all the hash H combinations. He's coming back now. H, which is done. We've done the hash T, we've done the hash H. So I guess we do hash globe next. Hash T hash yeah. T hash H globe T hash globe H T H hash globe T H globe here he comes again H no that's not it uh, I'm probably just missing him probably just like five symbols in any in no particular order right okay, here I'm trying to brute force four. Oh shit, he's absolutely going to walk in this time. This is not going to go well. Now we just turn around on the spot, okay. Uh, behaviors. 
Okay, that was TH, right? T globe. H hash. T globe. Hash H. All right, start with globe. Globe hash. T H. Ah, wrong one. Globe hash. H T. Globe T. Hash H. Globe T. H hash. Globe H. T hash. And last, last of the 24. Globe H. Hash. T. Nothing works. Nothing works. So what the fuck am I missing? I have no idea what the fuck I'm missing. I mean, this is exciting watching 20 minutes so far of doing nothing but brute force this. H, those are the right four symbols that I've got books for. And then the Book of Renthius, he's the, he's the hammerite, I guess. book hidden somewhere? Who knows? I don't know. Wait. Am I supposed to just magically know what the mission author has decided? Alright, let's, let's try a different approach. Let's try these four symbols. And then one other. I feel like that's unlikely. Like, I'm here I'm using meta knowledge, right? But people do four symbol codes because that's what you've got in Thief 2, right? There's a the uh, shipping and receiving or digit combo locks are typically what's powering these things behind the scenes. So... to know my way around this place pretty well. I didn't really examine this locked door, right? Where's the guy who patrols this room? There he is. with that skull. Nothing, nothing, nothing. You saw nothing in no one. The fact that this guy has, this room has a guy sitting up on the balcony looking over it as well, as well as the long patrol through it. It's really a hostile room. And there's all these lights that I can't put out. Is that another one of the things there? Okay. So we need to figure out some way to activate the skull lock there. And we need to figure out this rune lock. I have no clue on either of them. Um... I mean, do we lockpick the skull lock? Do we lockpick the skull? I guess we can try. It sounds like a lock. Like a lockbox, right? Way too bright. Can we put this out? No. What a... Uh, what a shitty uh, 
mission design. Hey, you got all these, you got these tools, you got very few of them, but they're entirely useless anyway. Alright, can we reach it from here to look at No. Alright, I'm going to try going around the other side, I want to know where, where this guy is. Guess he doesn't see me. Been answered. It doesn't. We can't lockpick it. All right. Did I go out those doors? I didn't, did I? I went up the stairs instead. I guess I should see what's what's out those doors. Shit! Think of the guys coming in. Okay, the upstairs guy did not fully twig to me then. There's the long patroller. I'll wait for the, the room patroller now. To come through, so we uh, can go behind him to check out what's through these doors. Because I guess it's the only place I haven't been yet. But yeah, we haven't got the, the thing we need from this town. Somehow there's a key there, I suppose, that we missed. I don't know where. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to hunt through look up the walkthrough again, I'm quite sure, it's like, sure there's a solution, but, it's so bright, these tiny candles are super bright. Oh, there's another book, there's another fucking book. Book of Lender, okay, we have another, another glyph. Five glyphs indeed. Or maybe that's all we need for glyphs. Where does this take us though? Down? But we're already down as far as we could go. It's going a long way down. Oh, is this taking us to where the portal actually is? Through the sound of. Wait, is that a figure I saw? It's feet. Oh. I see the townsfolk out here. We found them, everyone. Good job. <laughs> they found us too. I see, we just got immediately into their traps. Who dropped on my head there? I mean, we knew that they were booby trapped, but... There was, there was nobody there, like, I just got killed by nothing. Oh right, I see, there's one of the three things there, okay. So what the fuck am I supposed to do here? Except get murdered. Doesn't seem to be any wind up, any uh... Well they don't seem to trigger, trigger to that. Can we set them off? By setting off other explosives. I don't seem to be able to give this cuddly surprise a uh, sufficient poke to set it off. Hmm. 
No, this doesn't seem to work. And now I've uh, obviously made things harder for myself. <laughs> so wait, isn't that... S then there's four things that we found? So how am I supposed to do this? How am I supposed to magically know what to do here? Or is this one of the stupid uh, uh, go behind them where they don't see you line of sight things? Is that what it is? It probably is. I can't see which way they're fucking pointing. Oh, right, there's a little particle beam in front of them, right? Extremely faint. Almost impossible to see. This guy's is there, so... Hang on, how are we going to get back around to this guy? This guy's particle beam extends to the wall. This guy's particle beam... We can't squeeze in on just next to him there. As far as I can see. Hang on. We're gonna have a quick save. We'll, we'll quick save back here, right? Yeah, it's almost impossible. Can we put these out and see, see the particle beams better? No. Mission design. It's just like, you don't get any help, you just have to fucking. Uh... Now I can't even see this guy's particles. Okay, he's facing. He's Is he facing slightly right? I can see the particles against the walls there, so we can squeeze around here. This guy's particles. It's just so I don't even know if you can actually see any of this. I can barely see. We're going straight up to there, as far as I can see. Okay, so we might be able to get around him. I don't know. It's so hard to tell. It's so hard to see him. So I'm looking for like tiny, tiny paint indications. Oh my God, who's who's who saw that puzzle in? didn't kill me. I don't know why it didn't kill me. <laughs> Who saw that puzzle in Thief Gold in, in the Bone Hall and thought it was to, one to emulate? I don't know why this is doing what it's doing, but... Alright, now we want to go around this guy again. We have a health potion, I suppose we use it. And then is it around here? I've forgotten. It is. Well... So hang on, if that's one of the three things, then what is in the safe back in the town? Anything? Like this book says, right? Illustria Brillinor and Cinderdal. Brillinor was the one that Marcus was supposed to have, so. I'm very confused then. Might as well eat our food as well. Where is it? Okay. Healing has been done. Let's eat our deer leg. Nothing. Um. I'm going to have to put that on one of the three pedestals, for sure. Alright, we've got the five glyphs. What was the fifth one? 
That's like an eye. Okay, a couple eyes sort of thing. We can go back into the glyphs. Oh, this is an annoying situation because we've got this. People patrolling just outside here. And we have only light, light to stand in. Where's the room patrol? I don't know. That guy's standing up there. Ah. Uh, in a room where you have to move between the pools of light, it's just aggravating. But like, I haven't got, I haven't done this optional one. I guess this is, I haven't done that. One. At least the piece to get some information is is optional. I don't I have no idea what what key is needed here. We're gonna have a guy coming through this door any moment now. The long the long range patroller, I think. I don't want to wait till, till he comes and goes so we can go through there. There he is. Right on time. this room friend to move on. We can move. Let's quick save there, it's a relatively safe spot. Now we've got the guys coming in and out of this room as well. Don't know what their timing is like right now. coming down. Timing wise it's alright. It's not perfect but it will do. At least gives us a window to get up there without being spotted. Okay so we have hash th globe and where's the missing, where's the, where's the i one? That's not it either? Well, you design a mission where I need to find some random number of things hidden in some random number of places, and that, like as if I somehow am supposed to know this. Are there six of them? Are there eight of them? Are there. Do I just push all the buttons? To go back to town and get the stuff out of the safe. I thought I'd exhausted everything I could do in town. I was coming along here because it seemed like that's that's all that was left for me to pursue. But okay, he's not facing this way. Make sure they don't see me as I'm going into the, the lit areas. 
I could put the one I have on the thing, but that's not going to do me any good. Where's, where's the second guy? I've lost, I've lost like one. Did he else go in that room? There he is. Oh, they're stuck on each other. That's cool. Now he's going into that room. No? Okay, so I will. Controller coming. And this guy. Long range patroller will see us, so we kind of don't have many options for where to wait for him. Hmm. I mean I suppose maybe following long range patroller upstairs is actually the quick way out. <laughs> to be quite honest. It is, isn't it? Or going up the stairs ahead of him. Okay. Oh, except we've got the guys up there to... Ah, fucking hell. What the fuck am I even doing? I don't know. I mean, it looks like we've got everything down here. There's three things down here. So what else is in the safe? Maybe the safe holds the key to the second one. I don't know. Because we've got the guys patrolling up there that we've got to avoid. Maybe we can tell you about one of them, but... Getting them angry doesn't... You know what, let's make a proper save here. In case this is all just a wild goose chase. Oh, can I even get back up? Maybe? That seems doubtful. Okay, I can. I also might be able to lock pick the 30 surprises. I don't know. I don't know if they are fully functional as as landmines. Well, these guys might not might only take one 30 surprise. These aren't. These guys seem less less calm and collected than their friends. This way? I don't remember the patrols at all. Yes, they do come back this way. Maybe they don't. Or maybe they don't. Hey, some loot. Wait a minute, this is this is not the way out, I thought this was the way out. Yeah, I've hit a dead end. 
Uh, it was a dead end for this poor fellow. Let's hope it's only a. Uh, a cold as that for me. This was the entrance. Right, yeah, because I remember this hiding hole. Right, because we had to get past this guy. All the way down that passage, alright. Wasn't there another way to go? Out here that I didn't go. where we came in, right? I don't remember if he comes up quite this far or not. I'm just going to wait and see because I'm still wondering what's down that left hand passage. Seems like he doesn't come in here. Don't think I've ever been in here. Oh, this is where there was a guy just chilling, right? Just sitting and chilling or moving up and down in this room. Right, I didn't actually explore this room. I saw the guy and didn't go this way. I thought I saw the guy. And I'm hearing sounds like a guy. Yeah, there's a guy there. Can't tell which way he's facing. Seeing movement, being stuck on this tiny little light. Or is it the candle I'm seeing? What am I seeing there? No, oh, that, that, that's, that's a guy. That's definitely a guy, okay. Some skulls, some boxes. This guy is going to have to get the uh, cuddly friend treatment. Because I don't see any way to sneak past him. <laughs> I guess we can sneak past him. So he's probably gonna kill me. I 
Well, he's upset. He doesn't like teddy bears. Come on, there's nothing here, mate. You imagined it all. So one, one cuddly surprise is not enough for these guys, either. Bears right over there. All right, I need to sneak around him. Who's paying to sneak around? So what have we got? Another book. My, my brothers are gone. We were abandoned, tricked, our own blood sending us here to guard a wretched door. For years we patiently waited, guarded the guards' relics until Brother Izon collected them all and placed them in their ritual room, blinded by madness. The portal opened. I should correct myself. A few of the portals opened. My time down there was not wasted. The ancient books in that unknown origin were incredibly useful. From what I gather, the ritual chamber is not a place of origin, but acts as a node to control all of the portals. I cannot be certain, but they act as a transition from the inscriptions I have studied. The portal we guarded was nothing more than a transition back to Port Erinth. I'm not sure how this served the demons, perhaps allowing them to keep an eye on the relics? There are two other portals in the area, and I believe when all three relics combine, they must also open portals elsewhere. All this knowledge, I hope, falls on the wise. Perhaps Varentheus will find his way here and find out what I have written. Brother Varentheus refused the task of guarding the portal in the ritual chamber. He accused the keepers for bringing upon this world, bringing this upon the world, and took up a fallen religion. Banished from our order, he could not stray far, for he was not allowed, and now he is living in the town itself. I wish him well, but soon all of this life will be no more. The portals have opened, and I have narrowly escaped my life. It seems I am down to cowardice. The shadows move with a hatred no god can thwart, and I can't imagine what would have created such demonry. Brother Thessalus. So the portal that they guarded was a transition to Port Erinth, and there are other portals. Okay, so finding all the stuff is actually not the solution. It's going to make things worse. Is that what he's saying? Can we get out of here? Probably not. Right? Yeah, it's something set up to block that. Okay. Well, most. Information, I guess. I don't think it's useful to me in any way. We did learn something useful. We learned that these all these guys take two teddies each. So. Hello? Now we still have the loot gold, don't we? 2300. We're still 500 or 400 short. Oh god. Oh, okay. 300 is short. I mean, it's kind of... kind of silly in a situation like this to have a loot goal. It's like, oh yeah, save the world. Oh, but also collect a bunch of loot. That wasn't worth much, but it was worth, I guess, something. 220 left, somehow. It would be, it would be also be very funny if I do eventually figure out how to do the mission myself and end up having to look at the walkthrough for uh, the loot goal, but... Yeah, nothing more here. Okay, so that was not super helpful. skulls if we need them. Nothing in the barrels. Never hurts 
to check, but... Okay, so that was... I don't know. A mildly useful place to go. So am I... Do I just go back to town then? Am I missing a piece of information that we need? I guess. I don't even know what I'm trying to do now, because having read that book, what am I trying to collect these things for? Like, the portal isn't going to... Oh, it's the door. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, it's a ladder. Oh wait, we can't get back to town. The power's off. We soft locked then? Uh, I guess I guess I'm gonna have to resort to the walkthrough right away because I, I don't know nothing nothing uh, nothing has been quite adding up and it's been the best part of an hour already so I'm gonna end the episode here I'm gonna look at the walkthrough and next time I'm do I just look for one clue as to the next thing I need to do or do I just read ahead and have the whole thing laid out for me I don't know at this point um, floundering around is just the worst thing in any mission. But that's where I'm at. So, hey, yeah. See you next time for some, at least one less piece of floundering. Um, hopefully.